What's going on, YouTube? My name is Legendary Lee, and today it gives me wings. Ladies and gentlemen, here we are with another Pokemon trading card game opening of Scarlet and Violet 151, 151, 151, whatever you want to call it. Today we have the Binder Collection, something I've been trying to find uh, in retail stores, but I haven't been able to find anywhere. No Walmarts. Oh my gosh, stupid camera. No Walmarts, Targets, or anything. I've had it, but I did find it in a GameStop, and I actually had like $20 worth of rewards for GameStop, so I got this thing for 5 bucks, which is... Pretty great, you can't get much better than that, but here it is. There's four packs, I believe, um, and a binder in here. Yes, 20 page binder with nine um, slots in each page. Um, so yeah, I'm curious to see how good a quality the binder actually is. So we're gonna go ahead and get into this box, check that out. And uh, as we do, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below. I do all sorts of Pokemon trading card game content here on this channel. And if you're into that sort of thing, you're gonna love it here. All right, let's get into this bad boy, let's see just how good a quality this binder is for $25 I mean for four packs and a binder that's not bad really it's really not um let's see here okay okay um it's not terrible the plastic this is kind of like a it's no like ultra pro type of plastic it actually feels kind of small in terms of how big the binder is let's see the sleeves here let's get the paper out of it there's another piece of paper right here. I think I actually am going to use this for my master set of Scarlet and Violet 151. I wasn't going to, but I actually just recently decided when I was taking a shower about 20 minutes ago. I think I might uh, try for a master set. They, these seem pretty standard um, sleeves in here. The outside is just like a kind of like a linoleum type of plastic. Um, not terrible quality. I've, I've seen worse, but I've also seen much better. Like an Ultra Pro, like a leather binder, obviously is going to be much better quality than this. But this is not bad. It's really not bad. So you get that. And of course, the four booster packs of 151. Here we go. Interesting that there's not like a code card in here because there's almost always like a code card because there's some sort of promo that's typically in um, these things, but not this time, just the binder. All right, let's take it back to the one times. Four packs here, 151. How is your 151 journey gone? Mine's gone pretty okay. Pretty okay, I've got some pretty decent hits. Um, yeah, it's definitely some pretty decent hits so far. Uh, not the best cards. I haven't pulled, like, the hit cards or anything. Um, but I did pull the Alakazam Art Rare, which is a really solid card. I like that one a lot. It looks really good. All right, let's go ahead and get into this thing. We've got a Bellsprout, Dugtrio, Clefable, Tentacruel, Nidoqueen, Wheel. Ooh, there we go. Is Zapdos DX. I don't believe I had that one yet. Gotta go right at home in that binder. All right, next card up here in today's Pokemon card opening of 151, 151 rum. That's all I can think about, 151 rum every time that I open 151. Let's go with the water energy here. Ah, it ain't, a, it ain't a legendarily opening unless it's, I guess, the exact opposite energy. Um, when it comes to like the water and fire guesses, I swear it's like almost always the exact opposite of what I guessed. All right, we got Aerodactyl there and a Chansey. Oh, look how cute that Chansey is. So cute. All right. Next pack up here, a 151 rum. Oh, it's the triple P, sorry. The penultimate Pokemon pack. We got three packs left. If you're new around here, penultimate just means second to last. That's it, simple as that. But we always have our second to last opening. It's called the triple P, the penultimate Pokemon pack. Oh, in hopes that it would bring us some luck. It really hasn't. It really never has brought us any luck. I think maybe once we pulled like a really crazy car on the triple P. Um, but yeah, it never really, never really has. Oh, we do have a hollow fire energy though. Love to see that. I love the hollow energies they threw in here. Um, just because I love hollow energies. I collect all sorts of hollow energies from all sorts of different eras. Um, all right, let's go. We got a leftovers, a Charmander, some more leftovers, and an Almastar. Okay, we're not doing so great so far. Just one Zapdos EX card is all we've gotten thus far. Can we end? with some last pack magic and bring home something crazy in today's 151 opening. Let's find out, shall we? Here we go. There is your code card, folks. For those of you that play and dabble in the online game, let's go with a psychic energy. Okay, steel or metal, whatever you wanna call it. Or right, we got a Rattata, Squirtle, Lickitung, Venonat, Persian, Muck, Daisy's Help, Coughing, 
Omnite and oh my goodness, just a Kabutops Hollowware Route. That was not a great opening. Well, you know, one in four. That's typical state like hit rates we were used to in like the Sword and Shield era before things really got out of hand in Scarlet and Violet. Um, but yeah, one Zapdos EX from this set. I love the EX sparkle patterns that they have. Really nice hollow pattern there. But that's gonna wrap up today's video, guys. I hope you did enjoy this short video. If you did, my gosh, this stupid camera won't focus. I need a new camera so bad. <laughs> if you like the video, smash that like button down below. Don't forget to subscribe, like I said before. Until next time, stay legendary.